What's going on guys? Nate over here, back out with, at you with another video. Make sure you uh, hit that like button and subscribe, baby, because that's how we uh, YouTubers make money. Want to shout out to my 100 views. I did it guys, I got 100 views on one of my last videos and I'm so thankful. All the new subs, uh, Bradman and, you know, all y'all, anyway, not me bro, not me, not me. Anyways, here's what we got going on today. So, I built the frame for the door, finally. And I went ahead and bit the bullet and made a frame for that window. So I'm gonna put it out about here. I figure, come on, like, this is the easiest place to cut in at this point before I start wrapping. And then I'm gonna figure out how to place these around. I think we're gonna do them like, you know, every so often. But now that this door, it looks really high. I know it's just the, um, I know it's just, you know, a door. Oh, I'm trying to say. Basically, I gotta figure out how this is all gonna blend. So I already asked for some assistance from my guides. I said, whoever the Archangel is for logic reason, for building, manifesting, send him over, give me a hand. So hopefully they show up. Well, I know they're already here. But uh, yeah, let's get this going. I'll show you, so we'll see what happens. Hi everybody. Yeah. All right. So I started working on that wind, that door frame, and I put the window in too. So come check it out. All right. So I was sitting here last night thinking about what I was gonna do. Sitting about Ross Young, you know, just taking a gander, taking a look. And uh, I figured I was like, okay, so. This is going to start coming in, you know, like this. Um, why don't I do a square while it goes up and then slowly disintegrates as the, uh, as the dome comes in. So it just gets smaller and smaller at the top until it becomes part of the dome. Pretty cool idea, huh? I think it's going to work. Anyway, so, um, and I cut out the window hole too. And that's about where those are going to be. And the top of the window is basically going to be where the top of these are going to be, too. And since this is where the uh, toilet's going to be, I figure, uh, yeah, that's a nice little view. Okay. Um, and same with the inside. So I'm going to keep them square. Um, and then as the dumb's coming in, I'm going to start wrapping it back around with the cylinder walls, too. Look at what the concrete does to your hand. I think always going to cut myself. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, that's, that's it. What do you think? Man, this place is coming together. I thought I was going to finish it by the next full moon. That's not happening. My goal now is to go one more layer of brick up and then wrap the whole exterior. And then I think that would be a good stopping place. Um, take a week off, come back next week. Anyways. Bye. Ooh, oh, y'all. It's hot. I just looked at the weather. It says it feels like 105. It's only 97, but it feels like 100. All right, so I got a little bit done. Another layer up there. Another layer up here. That's about all I did, honestly. I put a couple more blocks up here. And there's a little bit in there. So anyways, that's where we're at. We're gonna try to do another bucket of mortar, see if I can hang in there. And keep going, because boy, I tell you what, it's hot. I'd like to go ahead and get this, this dump there done. And y'all know the bathroom, I gotta get that done too. So, see how it goes. All right. All right, boys and girls. See what we got going on today. Actually, got a lot done. I got a buddy helping me out too. He's taking a little break. Much deserved break. Much needed break. It's getting hot out here. Uh, all right. So check it out. We got the most of the wall for the um, for the bathroom door is pretty much at par. We just finished this one up, and this one's already done. So we're three layers up. We did it. The only thing is that I got these set. I got nine of them in here. 
So this is the first time I cut it. I'm just taking my time, looking at it, making sure, like, okay, how's this gonna work? I think my buddy Sam had a great idea, put mesh out on the outside of it, and that way you can wrap it around afterwards. I like that idea, probably gonna cut some mesh for it. But these are generally, the, the top of them are, are 70, or 67 inches, and that's the top of the window there, so hopefully it'll be nice and slow. It's gonna, if, if one's off, it's gonna, you're gonna tell, but we're, you know, we're not doing everything exactly. So. But we are doing it, and that's the point. Do it. All right, let's, uh, might go down the swimming hole, work a little bit more, we'll see what happens. Love you. Tell y'all what, building a dome in Texas in July is no joke, but I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Got all packed up. I just noticed something else I need to pack up, but that's how it goes. You probably pack up about 20, 20, 25 times. But guys, I got a lot done these last two weeks. One of my buddies asked me, he said, how much time do you have invested in it so far? Well, I kind of added it up. I just, just did two weeks. I did two more weeks prior to that. And then the first week wasn't really a full week. It was really a couple days. And these are five day weeks, but this week was like, you know, a 14 day week. So I have at least 30 days of full time, uh, full time work into this. Now the foundation that I did with Sandra, that one took, I think two weeks total, we were out here digging and stuff like that. I, if we added up all the days, it'd probably be two weeks. About a, a month and a half. And here's where I'm at, y'all. This is this is good. <clears throat> so, let's get a better view up here. It's coming up. It is coming up. So, so I'll tell you what I did over here. I did this last night. I had some buddies over. Wanted to show them what I'm doing, you know. Had some fire and fire water. And I wanted to finish this. This was something I wanted to get done before I left. And I knew I wasn't going to work a lot while they were here. And I knew I wasn't going to work the next day <clears throat> because I'm tired. But, so I wrapped it with this mesh, the same mesh as that. Because I figured, and I'll show you on the inside, cut these off and then wrap them around. That way, you know, kind of have more stability. Now these aren't like finished, They're, these are just in, and obviously it needs to be rasped. But I tell you what man, this is, this is gonna look really cool once it's dumbed in on top. Guys, yeah, got a lot done. Now I would've liked to rasp and mortar, but again, it's like these things, all these things take time. I'm only one person. And uh, and uh, yeah, it's hard, it's hard work. But you know, showing my buddy how I work and it's not just like grinding and grinding and grinding, you know? It's, it's <clears throat> going back to working at your own pace, doing single task things, focus on what you're doing, be, take quality, listen to your body. If you're hot, take a break. If you're water, if you need water, just whatever you need, you know? So you're not rushing to get everything done. I know I want to get everything done, but it will get done at the time that it needs to get done. That's just the rules. So this turned out pretty good. See, I don't like leaving extra stuff, because when I come back, I might put a little holder there, you know, who knows. This is what it looks like on the inside. And I already cut these. So that's, that's the idea there. But yeah, isn't that nice? And in the morning, I saw some golden sun come through them. It looks really cool. Really cool. But anyways, that's where I'm at. Third block. You know, I'm on the third block. I'm ready to rasp and wrap the top. And then after I wrap, rasp and wrap the second layer of bricks, then I'm going to finish these windows and keep going up, y'all. Keep going up. Oh, check this out. This is my pool. This is my tub. I don't want to show you the dirty water because I was, I was leisurely hanging out in it a couple nights. But uh, yeah, isn't this incredible? 
got some stuff done. But anyways, oh, I love you guys. I love you, love you, love you. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope this inspires you. And I'll keep you posted on the next. I'm going to take a week off, chill out, get some AC, you know. Whew. Maybe watch a little Netflix, chill. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Thank you, and I love you.